There's more to colour than meets the eye. Ever wonder where the brilliant blue feathers of Stella's jay come from? Or the metallic blue wings of morpho butterflies? These so-called structural colours arise when visible light interacts with nanostructured materials having short or long-range order. Morpho butterfly wings illustrate this phenomenon. Their colour vibrancy differs dramatically depending on the amount of dark pigment underneath the colour-causing structures, meaning on the back of their wings. Researchers are interested in mimicking these optical phenomena found in nature for pigments and dyes. In their communication in advanced materials, Shinya Yoshioka, Yukikazo Takeoka and their co-workers use the structural colour of Stella's J as inspiration for their own artificial design. They produced amorphous arrays of submicrometer sized fine spherical silica colloidal nanoparticles using a layer-by-layer -layer method. The negatively charged silica layers were bound together by positively charged polydialyl dimethyl ammonium chloride, or PDDA, and absorbed a carbon black containing quartz plates. Scanning electron microscopy revealed a homogeneous colloidal amorphous array with short range order. As the thickness of the array was increased up to 15 layering cycles, the colour was much more vibrant for silica particles aggregated on black plates than on transparent plates. When the thickness of the silica layer is increased, the colour becomes less saturated and appears white. They also demonstrated that the material exhibited the same colour, independent of the angle of observation, which is also the case for the Stellar's J. It was determined that the optimal thickness of the layer is between 1 and 2 micrometres which is comparable to the thickness of the air keratin structural layer found in the feathers of a Stellar's J. The colour of the artificial structures can be changed using different sized silica nanoparticles. For example, particles with a 260 nanometer diameter appear green, and those with a 300 nanometer diameter are red-purple. The colour saturation of the colloidal arrays on transparent plates can also be manipulated by controlling the blackness of the background via the orientation of two stacked polarising plates. When one plate is positioned at 90 degrees to linearly polarised light, the background is black, whereas parallel plates produce strong backscattered light. To find out more, please visit the Advanced Materials homepage. <laughs>